Anna Novini, and we are monitoring the breaking news on a deadly plane crash in Colorado Springs. There are no survivors after a private plane went down near the airport this morning. It happened before 11 a.m. in the southeast of the intersection of Platt and Powers. KRDO News Channel 13's Raina Novini has been tracking this story all afternoon long, and she joins us now live with the latest. Rana. Yeah, Robin Heather, as you guys mentioned, there were no survivors after a plane crashed here. I'm near the intersection of Powers and Airport near Peterson Air Force Base. Uh, the Springs Fire Department would not confirm how many people were killed in the crash, but they did say that everyone aboard the plane was killed. And ABC News has learned that two people were aboard the plane, and the plane was a Cirrus SR-22. If you take a look behind me, we are near where that plane crashed. It was in a field. No other structures uh, were were threatened or no other injuries. It, only the people on board were killed. We have seen more investigators here this afternoon. The coroner uh, just arrived a few minutes ago as well. They're still on scene. The NTSB, we are told, is on its way to head this investigation. Now, the crash, as you can see, caused a brush fire in this area. We have some video to show you when that fire first started around 11 o'clock this morning. The smoke was visible from miles away. It caused concern for many of you calling our newsroom to tell us about it. We don't have an estimate on the size of the fire, but crews from multiple agencies did respond very quickly and they were able to get that fire under control in about an hour. Again, we're expecting to hear from the NTSB here any minute now. As soon as we get some more information, we will bring that to you live right here on News Channel 13 at 4 o'clock. For now, reporting live in Colorado Springs, Rana Novini, KRDO News Channel 13. Rana, thank you. And we will have continuing.